one of the two main differences when I was with the Devils, which at the time were run by Lou and the Leafs before Lou would have got to the Leafs, was that exactly. So the cool thing, actually, one of the, the kind of cool things that Lou would do, as you mentioned, in the minors, everything's exclusive in the AHL to a uh, CCM Reebok, right? Um, so we had to use those helmets, gloves, whatever. But when it came to sticks, he, we were the only team that I knew of throughout the majority of my time in the AHL that could use any stick they wanted. And that was because when it came to the stick, Lou understood that there's more than just Reebok CCM out there that my guys will like. So I think they have to pay a fine or whatever. I don't know exactly how it plays out, but obviously the league's sponsored by those CCM Reebok, so they want everyone using it. But the Devils never had to. The Devils farm team never had to use CCM Reebok sticks exclusively. Um, we could use whatever we wanted. So I'm very grateful for his, uh, nah, my boys are going to get what my boys want kind of attitude yeah. there. But when it came to like the overall, you know, frivolous of like getting whatever you want in the locker room, that was definitely on a tight ship. You had to be, thankfully I was, but you had to be tight boys with, with the equipment managers and like the training staff, you know, so that you could be like, is it, is it, you know, is it cool if I just grab another twig right now? <laughs> and then the other side of that is I was pretty low maintenance guy as it was. Like, I didn't care if I was in one or two sets of gloves the whole time. Like, a lot of guys have two or three sets of gloves per, you know, day, like, per, like, time because they like to rotate. I was never really that guy. But when I came to the Leafs and, and just uh, a perfect example that I use is, like, the stick room. So the stick room, you know, with everyone's slot. But then there's, like, that second stick room where you go make a stick where you got to, like, saw it down or put a plug in it, whatever, to get it right there was really just like everyone had like at least like a 10 stick stash of brand new in the plastic and everything. And I remember asking one of the trainers, I think it was, it was, uh, it was either Bobby, Bobby Hastings or, or, or Pap Papineau, uh, Brian Papineau, the, co the, the two, um, two of the three uh, equipment managers of the lease. And I remember asking them in my early days, like I had played, you know, a little maybe over a hundred games or something, but nothing crazy. I was like, yo, you guys mind if I grab another stick? And I'm like, yeah, man, go ahead. Like, they're, they're right there. <laughs> and in my mind, I was like, what? You can just do that? It's like they're orange slices. It's just, yeah, right. yeah it's like, yeah, help yourself. <laughs> exactly. So, uh, as, uh, you know, like, honestly, going, like, playing with the Leafs was kind of like, so this is what the NHL is like. Okay. Yeah. Right? Like, I've been here.